I'm so glad to see another vanilla. I believe this is vanilla sugar. I'll put the name across the screen. It looks like they didn't release an expanded version of this one or either they sold out. Check on the left hand side while I pan out a little bit. Dollar General has these in stores as far as I know. Now, I would still check to make sure. This is a hand soap on the right and looks to be a shower gel on the left. I see sugar cubes. This is definitely vanilla. I can confirm that and I will put it across the screen somewhere. I like to see these unknown brands release collections of body care because one, if you try it, then it's going to reveal how much faith you have. And faith without works is dead, okay? The reason why I put so faith to test is because one, you're going to be probably looking for a lasting power, especially with the fragrance mist. Two, you're going to question if it's watered down. Three, you're going to question the same with the shower gel if there's one, if the hand soap, if there's one, if there's a bar of soap. Now, I don't see that often. I would have liked to have seen a bar of soap with this brand, with this line of products, and with the body wash or shower gel. Also, you're going to, going, you need to take into account as you're using this, if you're going to go ahead and do it and blind buy it, because that's what that is at this point. Whether the shower gel is running, whether the hand soap is running, even though it's for your hands, you need to check how the leather, lather is like, how your skin's going to interact with it, whether there's going to be allergic reactions, whether it's safe for your skin, whether it's formulated for sensitive skin. Lots of questions here. Now, you may be wondering why I, I ask all the questions. And that's why I ask all the questions. Because, and I keep it in the video. Because y'all might be having the same questions. You may have walked past this a couple of times and thought, maybe not. And then you come across this video, however, is thank you. Welcome here. Glad to have you here. And then, you know, it kind of gives you some sense of validity. And I'm a person I'm going to still encourage you, even though I may give it the green light, to do your research and tread carefully. Because you should. Whether it's a brand you know of, trust, or one you're, you're kind of on the fence about. The reason why I'm showing this brand is because one, it's like they release whole sets for certain scents. I didn't see that with this, but then the panning out you will see looks like an empty portion of the shelf that they that may have also been vanilla that they sold out and maybe they went i feel like maybe there was a fragrance mist in that empty gap that you see into the left and to, to room they took care of that fragrance mist first and to room they left the rest me personally if i'm trying something like this i need the whole set and i'm glad they did it like the other video to this that coconut coast should be already up but this vanilla one i would like to have seen more but i realized with vanilla anything vanilla flies off shelves as far as what i've seen so far with body care in all my years it flies off the shelf who don't want to smell like vanilla cookie a sugar cookie who don't want to smell like vanilla ice who i don't know no one that don't you know, and even if they like floral scents, that they still might want a hint of a cookie. They still might want a hint of a cookie smell. They still might want a hint of, you see what I'm saying, gourmandish. But it's gourmandish scents, vanilla cookies, pie, cobbler, cinnamon, pumpkin. Fall is approaching. We're almost in the season for it. You know what that means? Pumpkins, not Old Spice. Pumpkin spice. But if you would like to see more videos like this where I am going over things I see in the store, then on either side, there should be a playlist for you all to enjoy. And until next time, love you. When I think about love, it's one of the bravest, bravest things, things that you can do. It is patient. It is kind, it does not envy or boast, and it'll keep, keep you on, on the coast of not being rude or self-seeking, nor is it easily angered or seething mad, and it keeps no records of wrongs. It has no pleasure in evil, but it rejoices in the truth. And most of all, 